Hey everyone, Meowcity here. Welcome back to the Darkest Dungeon Estate. So today the plan is to go into the cove getting a few more deeds, which I did spend a bit of, so we need to get more, and getting the Bent Blade for the Duchess, which is really good for her human form. Just to kind of reiterate the fact that I need deeds if I can click the right thing. Uh, I spent a little bit on the furnace here, so making purchases cheaper. So now instead of like 1750, I think it was for the level two upgrade, it's 1400. And now the uh, level three upgrade is only 2400. So it's a lot cheaper. However, that being said, I need 17 deeds now instead of like the five or six it was. I also only need like four portraits, I think it is now to fully upgrade the guild. While we're going in for this, I'm going to be trying to get those. So between the reward here, I should only need seven deeds. So not even a full stack because I'm bringing Curdies again. We're letting the monster out of the cage because I'm bringing the sacrificial dagger again. And because the plus damage received is for the entire quest, I'm also bringing the overture box, which will up his dodge and his max health. So hopefully that helps out. In addition to that, hoping to help keep him alive, I'm bringing Rasputin, the martyr. So the plan here is uh, why everything's in this order. We'll go with this first. So the martyr is going to start with martyrdom. She's also going to be probably going first because she has plus 24 speed on the first round. So she'll like have absurd speed on the first round. She's going to start with martyrdom. What this does, she's going to mark herself. I think that works for the entire combat. She's going to up damage reflection by 35. On taking damage, heal 3 stress. This is also going to debuff herself for damage received. That's because she wants to damage reflect. This also goes hand in hand with the 15 extra damage she's going to take. So that's 35. 55 extra damage received because of concentrated flame. But now she has 85 damage reflect. Every other turn, she can heal herself for 37% of her max HP. And that's if she's I guess below 40% of her max HP. She can heal others if need be, and she can hit the first three rows with swipe, upping the damage they all receive with a debuff, so Curdies can go in with the letter opener and finish them off, getting his lovely buff. The second part of this plan is, since Curdies is going to be moving forward, eventually Martyr and the Forsaken are going to be moved back a row. So that means I can't use row two or run four one Forsaken. So he's going to be in row three. I'm going to be using Death Coil, Plague Carrier, and Army of the Dead. So we're going to be seeing how he does stunning and just blighting off the back with uh, destroying corpses and stuff like that. We'll see how he does damaging wise, but Empowered plus 100% crit chance. I will be empowering him and then the empower whenever he does that because he will have the Pestilent Crown. The next healing skill he does also applies to other heroes. So the empowered on this would be 9 regain or 10 regain instead of 9 and then plus 60% because I put Amethyst's head on him. <laughs> so 16 regain and then Blight would be uh, 5 for 3 rounds. So it's kind of nice. And then as an emergency healer we have Rosemary the Milkmaid who can also do some decent damage. I also have some scouting trinkets on. We're gonna see how this works. And the fun thing about this group, I can remember it. Both Rosemary and Matthias, so half my party do not eat. So I'm not even sure I need this much food, but I'm gonna take it just for extra healing and stuff like that. The smell of rotting fish is almost done. Oh, I don't like this split at all. So I'm gonna go down the right here first and then come back to the left. It's a good thing I kept some of the food. I'm going to keep as many of the Kyrios here as I can. And then get them on my way back. So, she did go first, like I said. She has to be in row 1 to use Martyrdom, so I'm going to start with that. It also gets everything else she has going. We're just going to Celestial Javelin off the bat, getting a Sea Maggot that'll blade it out. Actually, if I let her open, I was going to say, if I let her open her, would that take out this maggot? But I can take out this one and let this one blight out. That gets his buff going. It started already. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to stun 
the urchin, I think. If I can. Not too bad he missed. The slow death. And that got rid of his repost for now. Uh, we're just going to dust breath for the protection. Because that's what she can do. Let her open her this. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Stun you. Up your damage. Their formation re damage up the first fight. This is wonderful. Glittering gold trinkets and balls. Absolutely friggin' wonderful. So I do want the money. I don't need the bus so much, I think. So I think we're good to leave that. We did scout a bit, and I'm going to leave as much as I can there. So yeah, we're, we're going to leave that. Like I said, leaving this, the curios, uh, trap, 80, 60, 60. Curdies, really. Stepping up in the world, my man. I don't think anyone here has a forced interaction. I should double check that before I commit to this. All right. We do have a marked by the flock as well, so they might appear. Speak of the devil. Ah, hell. Well struck. Well, we'll do what we can. Okay, get rid of Archer. As the fiend falls, Curdies. Blossoms. Listen to the whispers. All right, so I can. S you know, they did change Army of the Dead on me. So I gotta look at this again. So what are you Oh no, they didn't. Was I think I'm confusing Army of the Dead with Blood Boil? Unless they turned those into two different moves. I swear Army of the Dead used to work like Blood Boil, but I could be wrong. Because I think Army of the Dead used to work like for every corpse there was, it did additional damage and stun damage. But nonetheless, um... Let's... Stun you for now, just so you do less. And then she's dodging everything. Pitchfork you. I was grasping at straws for that name the other day. It's a pitchfork, not a trident. And six damage from that reflect. I think what we're gonna do is go for the guy who has the action. Decimated. You know, if you would have hit, she'd have taken you out there, buddy. Ah, uh, we'll death coil. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. And that bites you. Dust breath you two. And then you have fun. <laughs> I wasn't even meaning to feed that to Curdies, but it works. Ghoulish horrors. So I suppose I should start. Oh, I'd have room for this. Okay, never mind. Start stocking up on these because that's twelve hundred. 
1600 gold right there that's almost a gold stack and i'm not sure how high these stack up the other thing is i'm not sure i'm gonna need the white wine but it is an emergency heal if i need it but screw it oh it can heal rosemary i'm gonna go down here Screw these fog walls. Mariner, another misfortune. I want two food there, because two people don't eat. And there we go. Do to do do to do. You know, before I forget again. There we go. Blazing star is born. Hunger check. Again, suppose it's only two food, so it's fine. Uh, curties, here you go. Take that, take that, light up. You know, does this mean he's dual wielding letter openers? And we're not going to get ambushed, that's a good thing. I suppose I shouldn't have opened that, but that's fine. Alright. Martyrdom, get that reflect going. Hit the fishy. Once again, you may be hearing construction noises. I'm doing my best to reduce it. Um, try to take out Fishman. I guess we didn't. Reflect takes them out. Destroy. Now, do, 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 I think if we do Death Coil and take them out, it might blight these two. There we go. Oh, Crimson Curse. One of the few people who could get it. These are only attacking her. <laughs> or a flucked is going hard here. Alright. Letter opener. Let's get one with more health. Eradicated. Revival. Get your health up. A really strong heal there. And then I believe you can army of the dead and take this one out. I like this Forsaken. I really do. A trifling victory. And then I think I can leave that stuff. Nonetheless. You know what I might be able to do is camp and get rid of one of the firewoods. I don't have anything that's for until camp. Yeah, we can take this one out. Obliterated. I'd say it was obliterated. And then I doubt we're gonna stun. So what I can actually do this time is get this up. That'll get us the Aegis, and then I can go forward from there. I am interested to see how hard he'd get hit once he finally does get hit. All right, I do gotta look at this if I can, cause empowerment plus four damage plus stun chance. Uh, so seven to eight, and we actually might stun, but not a good chance. I could. Oh, it's activating this too. Interesting. I want to see how high this goes. 
14 and 8. Wow. Because of all the buffs I had going on there. Let's get the one with more health. Destroyed. Locked. 3 damage. 5 blight. <laughs> Don't need to heal anyone. And take him out. I'm not just do crit. It. It's not even that powered up quite yet. Success so clearly. Okay, so like I said, fire would take portrait. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Even if I feasted, it's only for food. Not that we need it, because the only person that would really heal is Rasputin, so. We'll eat Torful. From there, patched maps for scouting chance. I think we can do Night in the Cold because her speed doesn't really matter after round one, which she is absurdly set up for. No one is stressed out, so let's heal this Blight. I mean, okay, I guess what I could do is get the stress on him from Unholy Prayer, get the healing gun protection and all that, and then get the minus. Oh no, I can't do that. I can still get the protection and healing gun. It's not that much stress. All right, cool. The light. The promise of safety. Alright, let's wrench this open. A handsome reward for a task well performed. Don't think I need the drifter's buckle. Alright, let's do that. Leaving that, like I said. Still Curtis. Looks like it. Alright, we scouted all that. Key's gonna be used over there, it looks like, so we're gonna go there. Bypassing this for now. Just to get rid of the key, we're gonna go left, then we're gonna go right, then we're gonna go to the other side. So. Martyrdom. Just getting set up. Let's get rid of the bosun. Um. Actually, can I just get rid of the bosun? We can. I think he can heal and stuff like that. And then it blights the rest of them. Let's get rid of the Brawler, because that's a bleed instead of straight damage. If it's straight damage onto Rasputin, that's more of a hurt on the grouper. The will to fight falls. Trooper nearly took itself out with reflection. Trooper did take itself out with reflection. Uh, can't do snifter to share, so we'll just do this. I don't believe that gets his buff going because it was a corpse. But we can do this just to double heal. didn't work. Let's see if we can't get Curtis another buff. Not to say he's not strong enough already, but... 
a brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. Absolutely ridiculous. I will leave it for now. Heading to the left, secret door. I don't even need to go. I suppose I should go to this one just to uh, get the exploration for the rooms. Not that I necessarily need it, but it's helpful. Take out Supplicant, because Madman. Pitchfork that. Boom you. Light the rest. And they'll go at Rasputin. And get reflected. <laughs> uh, fun times. Fun times. The <laughs> blood. I'm having too much fun with this, ain't I? Not sure that's gonna stun. I don't think it could have, but oh well. I think that reflect. Oh no, reflect is not gonna do it. So we're just gonna do this so I don't forget after the battle. And Curtis can do this. Which now I have to redo all that, but Curtis gets the buff. As victory is do 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 resistance. And right here. Use key. Finding this portrait's helpful. First test. Now it must be carried. I suppose I could just trade out the money. Also, I don't think I'm gonna need the food. I actually can't use it on amethyst or anything there, or not amethyst. Um, keep wanting to call her that. I don't know why. I don't even think that's her name, like her uh, canon name, but the milkmaid Rosemary. Uh, then past that, do, 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 do. probably going to regret losing the jades, but screw it. I'm almost out of torches. Lovely. As the light gains purchase, search this. Spirits are lifted. I don't think I can hold more busts, right? I don't necessarily need those ones. Some of the other heirlooms that I need to start bringing home right now. Mostly the deeds and the portraits, if I recall correctly. And then after that, I'll focus on portraits. Or that, not that, um, busts. I'll get anything here on the way back. I'll do this on Rosemary. Try to de-stress her. Ambush or not. Get that on the way back, definitely. That's why we have the medicinal herbs. I can at least heal her during this fight, so it's not the biggest deal that the trap was hit. Okay, that is a damage reflect. Interesting. I can take out the seas later right now before it's a nuisance. <laughs> I can take it out that easily. That is so fun to me. Um, yeah, let's stun the throw. I thought that one might be bad if he hit. And then we're gonna heal you. Of course, you're going to be the target of any stress attack now. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, let's stun you. Impressive. Easier to take out now. This will probably do the job. Up damage on Maggie if I need it. Up protection there, not that it's really needed. Damage reflect that. Should 
just because I can. I don't think that carries through battles, by the way. We'll see. Executed with impunity. Is that claw amulet again? Be wary. I think I'm gonna dump it. Precipitates a dizzying fall. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave. I mean, some stuff that's not necessarily bad. And if I got rid of one of the foods for this, because I do think I have too many foods, considering only Curtis and Rasputin eat, I could bring like the Book of Intuition, for example, or the Green Signet Ring, which is actually not a bad common. And we could see what we get in the future, just to see if we need to trade it out. Probably should do this too, so she can do her martyrdom. I knew I brought too much food. I just wasn't sure I'd need to use it on Curtis. All right. Well, they seem to have healing on lockdown, considering how much sustain everyone else has, which is nice. Um. I know I should probably go out the thrall because of the explosion, but that won't happen until like second turn. So let's get this stinger out of the way. I really don't like him, so let's. I was gonna say let's stun him, but I guess not. Sharpshooter. Ooh. I am on my seat's edge just because if he does get hit, that's gonna be bad. I am very surprised at how little he is, though. We're all needs to go. It's 20 damage is ridiculous. I mean, he only has 29 dodge. I'm not sure if something's going on there. Or if I'm just getting incredibly lucky. Either way, I'm not complaining. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. A little bit more damage there. Oh, there we go. I was expecting that to do a lot more considering double damage, but that was a slow damage move. So, that's fine, that's fine. And they gave him rabies. Minus 10 accuracy for 15% more damage. I might keep that on him now. Truth be told. Because 35 to 39 damage. Another one falls. Remind yourself that overconfidence. Yeah, we, we can leave the boss. He was healed for two whole health. Ah, should have done it with a fortune waiting oh well. to be spent. Do this before I forget. Oh, nice torch. And portrait. I can take that. All right. Are they trying to burn the portrait. And there's going to be another fight right there. Ah, really, Rasputin? Well, here's Journal of Darius. Six of six if you need it. Go ahead and pause it if you need it. Otherwise, I don't think I need anything there, right? Okay. And blood suckers that I might get blood off of. I've had very bad luck with that in the past, though, so we'll see. Get the uh, mark and stuff going. Let's hit the one in the back. 
Death Coilet. It's gone. Lighting the rest. Then letter opener. Let's get this supplicant. Sycophant. This is just ridiculous. <laughs> I think it's worth the trade, though. Especially considering Rasputin's kind of like totally covering him, it seems. Let's get rid of Supplicant. Heal. Get rid of Stun. And heal. That was such a powerful move to be able to do. For like a free action. Alright, taking what I can. You are craving. Build. They can be beaten. Feel bad that I don't have a key for this section, but that's fine. Also, a little sad that I haven't run into more talents. Twenty-three damage. Absolutely bonkers, there, my man. Already been looted. Let's get another torch because I'm running low and deeds. I need deeds. So I think the safe thing to get rid of would be the green signet ring. As good as a very common trinket is that it is. I think it's the safest bet to get rid of unless like I'm getting rid of supplies or other things that I would rather keep. Also, what's with the deeds and the portraits in the sconces? I really have to ask at this point. Still can't believe they gave him rabies and it just made him stronger. I'm keeping rabies on him. I'm keeping the rabies. Get more deeds, that's actually really good. Torch, food. Oh man. I'd rather trade all of this for one more emerald. Running into them more than I'm running into um, actual walls this time around. Okay, let's let's keep going. I think I've run out of all of my normal buffs, so I might want to camp soon. So they can eat again. What's bad quirk to get rid of here? Anything on him? I just don't really want to get rid of marked by the flock. Hell. Well, there goes that. So I'm gonna burn this. Gathered close in tenuous firelight. Uh, I'm gonna Peace risk companionship. the feast. I don't think that it helps Rosemary because she doesn't eat. That gives me two hunger checks and gets rid of some stress and heals them. Then we can do scouting. Prevent nighttime ambush. She can take the speed loss. Minus stress on her. And we can encourage. And we're fine on stress. In Radiance, may we find victory. And with luck, we might find more food, so it's fine. So, get this going again.
Pop goes the Weasel that can't hit Rasputin. Hit the Supplicant. It's Blighted now. Hit the Supplicant again. It should go down to Blight. That just leaves these two. Hopefully they hit Rasputin. That'll get the Reflect going. And the fight is practically over because of the Reflect. Oh, actually that didn't hit much harder. Oh, right, because she has all the plus damage on her already. <laughs> I'm like, why didn't that hit the air harder than it hit Rasputin? Because she has all the plus damage on her already. She was already tanking it. Which was a dangerous game, but I mean, when you have her health pool and damage reflected, kind of worth it. Uh, more deeds. Don't think I can take the money. The anti venom's not really worth it. Journal of Darius, Highwayman, two of six. Go ahead and pause it and read it if you need it. I'm. Um, you know what? I'm not getting another run in this episode anyway so screw it might get more heirlooms or another really good gem we do need to take out the messenger first but i don't think that's gonna be a hard thing to do especially now that he's in row two i'm gonna have other people go for him we're going to go at the Supplicant, take him out, so that's less actions going at us. Uh, just do this as a heal for now. If that blights, he goes down. That's fine. I'm going to try to army of the dead him to stun him. There we go. And that's gonna take my blight. A death by inches. We're gonna try to take. Oh no, he's in row. Yeah, we're gonna try to take him out. Cause if I take out the sick offend, Rosemary can't do anything to him. both missed, okay. Three out of four missed. Wow. Well, that's going to take him out. Because damage reflect. Yeah, depending upon speeds and who goes. We'll do this. Just because free action. Kindness. Heal up. Try one more time. 46. Holy hell. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. Yeah, we're gonna leave this for now, I think. Moving forward. Oh, another scout. That's awesome. Got the torch I needed. Keep me going. Um, really tempted to take this. You know what? Screw it. Might lock me out of a few interactions, though. No. I was going to do it, but no. I forgot about the curios that are in here. Like the um, barnacle chest and the uh, giant clam. Which this room could have been. Oh, 
All right. So let's go for the... I was going to go for the Guardian and one-hit him. However, that being said, the grouper is not going to attack Rasputin. He's going to attack the back rolls and try to pull. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's the rabies kicking in. So we'll stun him instead. Alright. See? Instead, we'll take that guy out. Just utterly obliterate him. Uh, we'll go for the Bleach Grouper here. He blades out. If that would have been 100% Reflect, that would have been so fun. Fine. Boom. And then heal thyself. I love it. <laughs> Pretty sure he goes down to Blight, so we'll just heal up. Taking what I can. Did not scout, it seems. I'm gonna pull a stupid. Reason that's stupid, not because the light is because those walls that you've been seeing are passed via torch, and instead of clawing my way through, it will send me to a random spot. Yeah, that could be the bad. Is lit. The path is clear. We so, only the strength to follow it. We'll see what happens. So no mimic. I'm a little disappointed. And I know hunger check as well. I'm just rolling dice at this point. <laughs> Something very bad is going to happen very, very soon. We got a little guy right there. He might help. I'm guessing this next room is going to be like the end. If I don't scout something really good, I'm probably going to dive out. I say that knowing full well I'm not. Oh, is that going to stun her? Lovely. Damage Reflect still goes. Keep that in mind. <laughs> it's a Blighted for three. If we do this, that just spreads the Blight. So Deep Stinger down. Alright. Trooper. Can't try it into I want, so let's heal up a tad. Plus 31 damage for the quest. Absolutely bonkers. Oh, look, a ruby. Uh, see, that's 8, 1600. If I found another ruby, which I won't, that'd be worth more. But I won't be finding another ruby. So. Screw it. Unfortunately. Now, what do we find here? No hunger check available, so let's keep going. Oh, unfortunate. Or fortunate, depends on how you look at it. With a singular purpose. Let's 
get rid of the stinger. Just cause. I think he's easier to take out, but nonetheless. The wounds of war can be healed. But never healed. Army of the Dead. Stun him, cause it's what we can do. And up damage receive into letter opener. Hey, another emerald. Okay, I said like anything on him was worth getting rid of. And we'll do this just just cuz it, it's getting hilarious at this point. I don't even need to do the damage reflect mark. Let's just get rid of the messenger and pretty much be done with the fight. Three blight, three blight, he's done. Then death coil you. So the rest can go at this supplicant. Thirties can go at the one with full health. Oh my! The rightful heir has returned. All right. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. And what's in this door? Just keep going, just keep going, making mistakes. Up damage receive. Take out Shaman. Shaman goes down to Blight. Erdes takes out Urchin. Now we take out Grouper, or not, then Stun Urchin, because no more repost. Take out Urchin. <laughs> Stunned, and I think literally anything I do with uh, Rasputin will take him out. Oh man, this this is so entertaining. I didn't think that like at, at this point I was kind of expecting there to be almost like a one-hit KO on him, but no, not not quite yet. Really tempted to trade out these talon feathers. We'll, we'll we'll just roll with it. Oh, look at that! I know exactly what I'm getting myself into now. <laughs> Were you surprised to see me? All right, we'll get her reflect going because I think the sharpshooter might be able to do some damage here. And I'm not sure what the cohesion here with the sharpshooter and the bosun are. But we're going to take out the stinger first. A powerful blow. Utterly. Wow. A singular strike. I guess there's no cohesion anymore. And we're going to stun you. I think the reflection took him out. It, that that hurts a little bit, not nearly as much as I was expecting. And just let the monster loose. Oh, look at that! Ceremonial seeth for the sisters. 
We actually did want this. Um, I think this is worth losing the Talon Feathers. So, minus 50% Blight amount, so she's not as good in her... I'm trying to think of the mode, so I don't have her on hand to look at live mode. But the possessed mode, she does a lot more, because on melee attack, buff self, 10 dodge, and on repose attack, which I believe she has to be in the... I don't want to say the right mode, but the, like, beginning mode to get, and then it only lasts a few turns, 10% uh, damage. So, it can be really good if played correctly and used correctly, and you have a little bit of luck. So that's a nice one. All right, one more fight, two more trink or two more curios, and then there will be an end to this madness. For now. <laughs> Up damage. I tried. Restoration. Hey, Curtis. Have fun. A devastating blow. I'd say that was a devastating blow. He instantly transformed. And then damage reflect. He's down to 15. If Mathis was a little bit up and I had different moves, I think I could have done this in one turn, but let's stun him. Prodigious size alone does not dissuade the shot. He's the monster here, not you. So Eternity's Caller for the Flagellant. Um, I see that this is the... I think I see that this is a crusty chest there, so I think I need a shovel for that. So let's get rid of these. Take that. Yeah. So I can try. I would rather have the deeds than the busts. Let's head back. You fun trinkets. A lot of money. A lot more than I was expecting. I think I got enough deeds to get at what I wanted. Despite its morbid aspect. And we got the bent blade for the Duchess. This maze seems almost traversable. So 21,000, almost 22,000, and a lot of heirlooms. <laughs> I'm gonna miss Curtis once he goes to level 3 and I can't use him for a while. He's a monster. He is a monster. I can't even hit next. Like, it, it's just going. 70... No, it, it's still going. Still calculating crests. Because I got 16 until instead of 12 for each batch. 96 crests from that only three portraits which is one of the things i wanted eight busts 10 collected deeds which turns into 19 total which i believe was more than what i needed to upgrade the blacksmith curdy's is still level three so i can use him and he has rabies, so the next time I use him, he has more damage out of the gate. Rasputin has kleptomaniac, so I may want to fix that. She also has penetrating, which is not the biggest thing on her. Matthias hit level 3 and has fear of rats. Rosemary hit level 3, and Curtis has Warren's adventure. I'm not sure how he got that from there, but whatever. Curtis does Curtis at this Once point. Our estate was the envy of the there was no town event. I lost my previous runaway. No one needs stress relief. So Rasputin can go in here and get Klepto off. I'll also probably put someone in the sanitarium. 
I have 31 of 33 deeds here, so I am just very quickly going to do this. And now the guild is maxed out. I don't know what I'm going to need portraits for anymore. Other than I think it's the bar tavern, which I don't really use unless absolutely necessary. Uh, there may be a few things in here. Yeah, like House of the Yellow Hand needs 100. So there are a few districts that need them that I could um, get rolling eventually. But Hamlet-wise, I am done, which is a nice feeling. I'm also going to get armor smithing. So now I can get everything for, say, Rosemary here until she hits level four or level five, which is amazing. Uh, so I can focus more on the furnace, which would just make things cheaper, which is probably what I'll be doing. There are now bosses available for me to do in the cove once I get to that level. There's still bosses I haven't touched, like the Incohate Flesh. I mean, there's bosses everywhere I haven't touched, if I'm being totally honest, so I need to do a lot of stuff everywhere. I kind of want to keep doing apprentice stuff. I'm just not sure where. So I will find out what I want to do and kind of go from there because I'm not seeing anything that looks extremely good this time around, which has been kind of what I've been going for. There might be actually in the quests here like bumper crop or something like that and then I could also get the poisoned herb but beyond that I'm kind of like eh so I'll figure out what I want to do for next time now that this series of events has kind of like been figured out and go from there <laughs> I'm kind of like at a loss up with curdies right now because man is a monster and I'm really tempted to bring him on like on a boss fight but anyway that'll be it for this time really helps out the channel if you like the video if you liked it dislike the video if you dislike it comment subscribe and all that youtube jazz and otherwise as always i wish you all well i'll see you next time and please have a good one